am a hot mess, honestly. I haven't even brushed my hair yet. It's early in the morning. I just finished my iced coffee. Ah, that was good. I've been putting a half a Premier Protein Shake in there this morning because I've been wanting to start my day with more protein. And then I had my protein bar. Right now I am going to get my shoes on because... It's time to go to the gym. I'm cold. I'm kind of tired. But I have not vlogged in three weeks. Three weeks. I ended up getting COVID. And that just kind of like threw me off my game there for a minute. So I'm back. And I will take you through my day. So right now I am put my shoes on hokas because I'm gonna go get my orange theory workout in um, as soon as I get my shoes on head into the kitchen and get my pre-workout going my little morning shot um, so stay tuned see you guys in there All right, so let me show you guys this. This is Kickstart, which is ginger, lemon, cayenne pepper, and turmeric that I just do, oops, a little bit of water. This is gonna be good for like in, um, digestion, inflammation, supports your immune system, supports your metabolism. So I used to do apple cider vinegar shots with lemon and water, but now I'm doing this little concoction so that and still a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. So basically we're going back to the apple cider vinegar shots with a kick because this powder has a kick. It's, the ginger in it is really overpowering, which is good because it makes everything else bearable. Down the hatch. Oops, where's the front? So, that's kind of what my thing, instead of doing greens, I'll do that. Okay, this is my little morning concoction for going to work out. It's a scoop of Pure Rebuild. This I take every day, even if I'm not working out or lifting weights, because you need that constant flow of creatine in the muscles. You want it to stay there. That's what's gonna help build the strength. And then this I only take, this is pre-workout. I only take this if I am working out, and I only take it in the morning. I will not take it for an afternoon workout because it'll keep me up and I only do half a scoop. These are both from 1UP Nutrition and my discount code is on the screen. I do both of these in the same flavor so that they complement each other and they're both watermelon and I love the watermelon. I've arrived at my workout. This is my little um, heart rate monitor. It's called the Link for Orange Theory. And I love it because you just attach it to your watch. And it makes life so easy because I never forget it. I always keep it in the car. Here's the little charger. And I, it's always charged and ready to go. like that we're done and when I'm in class I refill this with water and I make sure I drink this by the time I get home so right off the bat after my workout I'm already like 40 ounces in in water that's kind of how I stay on track with water so then I'll refill my 40 ounce Stanley when I get home and I'll drink that throughout the day 
and then I'll, I will refill one more time and I'll drink about half of that. So I'm at about 100 ounces of water right now, which is pretty good. This has been like on repeat for me lately. Half a cup of egg whites. Those are 25 calorie corn tortillas. And then I do some of this. Queso fresco. So good and satisfying. Do little like cheese, little cheese tacos. when I start a vlog and then I forget that I'm vlogging. I really hate when I do that. It's like I need a reminder or something, but I just got to my second workout of the day. I'm going to go do a lift and um, I'm really tired. This is where I feel like the effects of COVID are still getting to me because I feel just so tired for the second half of the day so hard. Anyways, I'm going to go get this in. I parked far away so I'll get some extra steps in. I'm going to go get this workout in and then go home, make a yummy dinner. This vlog is probably going to turn into a couple of days of my life because tomorrow I'm going to go to Trader Joe's. You guys love a Trader Joe's haul on my vlog. So, um, we'll see, but probably a couple of days of my life. That's okay. Right? Got my little morning this is what I've been having every morning, iced coffee. Uh, it is just Starbucks cold brew with the Cafe Latte Premier Protein Shake. I put about half in there, so there is 15 grams of protein. And my little protein bar, a Bear Bell's chocolate dough. So this little kind of like morning snack is 35 grams. That is my key for um, getting protein up, is starting with a lot of protein. Because my goal lately has been getting more protein in. Because I'm using that Pure Rebuild from 1UP Nutrition. I really want to maximize my muscle gains. Um, I also feel like I might have lost just a tad of muscle, or I just feel flat after having COVID. So I'm trying to put on that muscle because my goal with this cut in the first half of the year is to be leaner than I was before. And it's always harder to like cross like a baseline. Like if you've stayed at a certain baseline for a long time, it's hard to pass that baseline and create a new one. It's just your body fights you on it. So I want to be leaner than I was at my leanest last year. So that's the goal. Um, it's Friday now. I look crazy. Sorry. I just woke up. It's early in the morning and I self tanned yesterday, but I think I did a pretty good job. Like my hands, I haven't even washed it off yet. My hands don't look too crazy. I get tan on the inside. You see that, but that's okay. I, I just put self tan remover on there before I shower. I let it sit for a little bit and it comes right off. So today I'm going to clean out my fridge, go to Trader Joe's, run a few errands, so I'm gonna continue this vlog and take you guys along with me. What you blending up in here? Yeah, and, and, and this right here. Mmm. Ooh. Taste? No. How does it taste? That tastes like a Jamba juice. This is better than the last one. Mmm. Okay, so this protein, you guys, has the best macros of any protein powder because it's all egg white. So it's only 108 calories and 25 grams of protein. Okay, so, oh my God, this is so good. So this is 32 ounces. How much milk did you put in here about? 240 milliliters. So One cup? Yeah, basically gives me like 13 grams of protein. So this shake, so 
is 270 calories and almost 40 grams of protein. That is a really good ratio. Yep. Wow, that's good. Oh, there's a banana in there too. Mmm, the banana. The banana. Yeah. Okay, 300. Still good ratio. <clears throat> yep. For 40 grams of protein, you could have something up to 400 calories. Wow, that's really good. Tastes like Jamba for sure. I look crazy, but we are vlogging regardless. Oh my goodness. Okay, so how are we gonna go to the car wash if you don't have your car? Tyler's? Oh, that's true. Good. It is good, right? I love when they're... Oh, you're giving yourself a pat on the back? Yeah, it came out good. I'm enjoying it. it tastes like a, like a... Yeah. Like a Jamba. Mm -hmm. Porch time with the dogs, because it's finally a nice day in California. It rained so much this week here. It was crazy. We love to sit on the porch, huh, Charles? We love to sit on the porch and just get some vitamin D. I look crazy. I need to wash my tan off. I'm going to make some breakfast, a little something something. And then I am actually going out to Luna, my favorite spot later with It's a Little Girl's dinner with my cousin and my daughter so I'll definitely show you guys that I'll show you guys what I order there Hello. All right. Showered up, went for our little walk, had a little, a light breakfast because I save most of my calories. You guys know the drill already. I save most of my calories when I'm going to go out on a Friday. I like to save a good amount of calories. So I, I combine lunch and dinner. Oops. Let me change the battery and come right back. Um, I combine lunch and dinner into one so that I can enjoy myself. I'll probably have a little cocktail and, um, yeah. So anyways, um, drop my car off at the car wash. So that's, I'm going to go pick it up and then I'm going to go to Trader Joe's. So I will show you guys what I get at Trader Joe's, but I also got a Zara delivery. So I thought I would do a little unboxing, a little unexpected unboxing. I haven't been to Zara, but I went to their website and they had some cute things. I have to say the, I'm excited because the styles for spring and summer, denim, 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 and denim is totally in. And I love denim. They package this really nicely, actually. And you guys, <laughs> denim jackets have a chokehold on me. I have way too many, and I just keep getting them. But I don't know. I just love a denim jacket. Even, like, over with my workout clothes. Like, over my workout outfit, I think it looks so cute. And this one, I love like cropped and frayed and has this little pocket right here super cute I hope I hope I got the right size I will throw it on real quick this is the, the only thing I knew I was gonna love the other stuff who knows I also obviously took a shower and I look a little less crazy. All right. By the way, these are my CRZ yoga shorts and I love them for around the house. I need more colors for spring and summer. I'll be living in them. Oh yeah, it's perfectly oversized. Okay. I love it. I got a small instead of like an extra small because I wanted it to be like not fitted because so I have a girlfriend denim jacket that's got the frayed edge but it's fitted this is super cute 
safe to say you guys are going to be seeing me in that a lot. Oh, I think that Zara is really hard to link. They Their website is a disaster. So I'm going to put this up to the screen. You guys can look at what the um, style code is. Take a look. If you want to, it's the TRF crop denim jacket 8197 slash 057 slash 400. You can go ahead and look for it. Okay. I got this little top. Oh, it's so cute. It's a strapless denim top. It has some stretch. And from what I can tell, it, this is going to fit. I thought this would look so cute with my little vegan leather Abercrombie pants and some heels for all of the social events I don't attend. <laughs> I can't with myself. But love. That that's that's a love. I got this little top. I thought it was super cute. Like a little crop with some high-waisted jeans, kind of V's down. Oh, I like that. It's like seamless, ribbed. Cute. Okay. Last but not least, I decided to get a pair of jeans from them. I love my Zara jeans, but they're all ultra high waist, which I feel like right now the styles are like anything goes. High waist, mid rise, low rise. I decided to get a mid rise, non destroyed wide leg. So they are not gonna be super high waisted. I'll try them on. Okay, I love the mid-rise. My room is a mess. Ignore, ignore behind me, please. I have shit everywhere. But I love the mid-rise because it's not low-rise, but it's not ultra-high. These are... Oh my gosh. I, I love them. So cute. Alright, so this was a little bit hard to get on. It's not quite zipped all the way, but it will zip all the way. Um, it's a little tight. I probably could have gone one size bigger, but I think it can still work. You guys, I picked up my car, stopped at Starbucks, and I used the rest of my Premier Protein shake in here. So this is just espresso with Premier Protein. I'm crooked. I'm going to head in now to Trader Joe's, and I'm so proud of myself because I remembered a bag, which I don't usually do that. But all right, you guys, let's head into Trader Joe's and get a few things. So, I didn't get anything too exciting this time. I wish I did, but I'm going to do, I'm like in, I decided I want to be on a fish kick next week. I'm kind of craving fish. You know, I have to change up my proteins every once in a while. So, I am going to do a kale salmon salad with quinoa. I love the salmon at Trader Joe's. I just got some fruit, so I'm going to put it in the sink to wash it off. Um... Mmm, lots of mangoes. So, I might do salmon bowls too, so I got rice, the jasmine rice. I love that. I'm going to do fish ta tilapia fish tacos. So I got, I'm going to use the 25 calorie corn tortillas I have and make maybe like four tacos with some tilapia and cabbage. And then I'll make like a little salsa to, to use with it. And then I got tricolor organic quinoa to go with the kale and salmon. So half the week I'm going to do tilapia tacos, half the week I'll do like a salmon salad for dinner, and then I'll probably do falafel balls because I still have some. And then I got this tabbouleh salad to like add into my falafel ball, I don't know if you guys can see that, add into like my falafel ball salad just to give it more Mediterranean vibes. I also got light laughing cow cheese. It's only 30 calories per triangle. And I'm going to add that to my egg whites to make like a cheesy, creamy egg whites for only an additional 30 calories. And then I got some low sodium soy sauce and some bombas. These are so good, you guys. If you don't follow me on TikTok, by the way, if you do not follow me on TikTok, you should. But they are so yummy. They're a yummy little snack. And you get 45 pieces for 160 calories. So good. Okay, my kids just got home. So I finished this haul just in time. I knew you were going to walk in here right now. 
Look, we're bodysuit twins. Well, we are headed out to dinner and you guys know that my uniform lately, I kid you not, is bodysuit, a bodysuit, what can I wear my bodysuit with? Um, and Alyssa has apparently joined me because she walked in wearing one of the bodysuits as well. Um, but I just got new styles in and I love, I love the like muscle tank. I feel like they're very figure flattering. Actually, I like the one that you're wearing too. I think it's figure flattering as well. Let's see. What are you doing? Oh, you don't have it. <laughs> so I'm flapping oh, it. Oh, you're flapping in the wind? Um. Oh my God, I look so pale, mom. Oh, it's because I tanned last night. Anyways. I'll pop up a video of me putting together this outfit on because it literally helped me wear these pants because these pants are a little snug for me. But this bodysuit, they have different weights. So this style that I'm wearing is a heavier weight bodysuit. It's more compressive like shapewear. The one Alyssa's wearing is lighter. It's more for spring and summer. This one is a little more warmth to it because it's thicker. It has more grams. Um, but I got it in another color as well. And I love it. We are headed out to our favorite spot, Luna Mexican Kitchen. They have the best drinks. I was at Trader Joe's right now, and the um, cashier asked what I was doing. You know how I love small talk. <laughs> That's what I was doing. But I said, I'm going to dinner. Where are you going to dinner? Luna. And then another cashier heard me say Luna, and he goes, oh my gosh, they have the best spicy margaritas. And I was like, oh, they oh do! Oh my god, they have the best spicy margaritas. Do you see what I deal with, you guys? Anyways, um, so that's my spiel on the bodysuits. I have them linked in my Amazon storefront. I'll have them linked down below. I literally just reach for a bodysuit every time I'm trying to put an outfit together. Oh, and this is the other one I have that they sent. This is a new style also. The V-neck. This is also the heavier weight short sleeve. Um, I wore this last week, and it was really cute. I'll pop up a picture so you guys can see. Anyways. All right, you guys, we are headed to Luna, and I think we're running a few minutes late, which is not unlike us at all. Say hi to the vlog. Okay, cheers. Cheers. 